The Trikabi interface consists of two spaces. The personal one is for managing data by the current user. It is simple and is mainly for logging time worked and planning days off. There is a dashboard that shows time logged summary by day, a timesheet with a timer, manual logging, and an import button, a leave calendar, an interface for configuring data import, and some basic settings. The company space is for managing the data of the entire company. There is a timesheet, leave schedule, time reports, projects, clients, member directory, teams, access roles, and general account settings. However, not all users can have access to these items. Depending on the current role, some may see only a limited number of sections or have no access to the company space at all. Let's have a closer look at the company space. The company dashboard gives a bird eye view of the entered data. There are summaries of time log, leaves planned, alerts about missing time, and other information. The timesheet holds time log by all employees of the company and their days off. The timesheet is editable same as spreadsheet tables in desktop applications. Just double-click on a cell and change the content. There is also a filter and a button to save the timesheet as a report. The leave schedule section is where a manager can see and control employee leaves. Leave requests sent by employees can be reviewed and approved or rejected here. It is also possible to add leaves directly from this section. Saved reports are snapshots of timesheets. They can belong to a client or include diverse data. Time reports can be printed, exported into Excel or PDF, or made available online via a link. The project section stores information about company projects. And it is much more than just a list of projects. For every project, there are many settings, statistics, a plan and a cost estimate, assignment of teams and individual employees. The client section is a list of clients with brief information about each of them, including statistics with their projects and time worked. In addition to that, the system allows inviting client users into the current company account. Such users can get access to timesheets and time reports related to their projects. The staff section is for company employees who are the system users as well. Users should be invited by email. Once a user accepts his invitation, he gains access to the company account, but only within the limits of his access role. There are also a list of pending invitations and a list of former employees. Managers can form teams and set different roles for team members. A team can be assigned to a project, and all members will automatically get the access levels set for their role in the team. Trikabi offers advanced user access roles functionality. It is possible to create custom and edit already existing roles. Each role bases on a set of permissions that can grant read-or-write access to various parts of the system and user data. By default, there is the owner role that cannot be changed, the manager role that grants access to almost all data and functions, and the employee role that allows access only to the personal space. In the system settings section, there are many options available. It is possible to adjust a current company profile, a subscription plan, general account settings, timesheet fields, a list of time types, working and non-working days of a week, a list of public holidays, and leave types. There is also a handy feature that allows every user to have access to multiple company accounts. A user can be invited to many accounts as an employee or a client and create company accounts. For more information and to sign up, please visit trikabi.com.